Chimera, let go, live now. It is Tea Time Tuesday. Our bit of wisdom today. Ooh. Be yourself. Oh, it just feels like that is a common, just be yourself. Go to that party, just be yourself. You're great, just be yourself. What does that really mean? I have an experience when I was not being myself, but I, here it was. I was a new instructor. My goodness, this must have been back in 1999. And I was teaching this 10 week human relations leadership course. I had a group of 40 professionals in the room, brand new. I had been through the class a couple of times and now I was the facilitator. And I got feedback at the end of that experience. And one of the feedback cards said, phony, canned, inauthentic. I cried. I cried on the way home. And I got it. It was accurate. I was doing something new. And I was probably, I'm sure, I was basing how I was doing what I was doing on what I had just learned and my facilitator and my instructor and how they did it. So it came off as inauthentic because it was. So how many places in your world might you unconsciously be duplicating how somebody else does things? Maybe you've got a story that they do it right, they do it well. And what if there's a different way to do it that's uniquely, fabulously you? What are all the ways that you can unveil your true self to have those experiences be authentic and kind and caring? Here's to you, sweet, 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 powerful, fabulous you, unveiling yourself to be the joyous person you know. I look forward to playing with yourself again soon. Mm -hmm.